somebody show me this link and ask me what this can be there's something happened on July 15 um, this is a telescope that is located on Hawaii and it's a very sensitive camera that is you know looking I mean the purpose of this thing is to watch the clouds and watch the sky but there's something happening in um, July 15 a little bit before the sunrise um, there's this, there's a lot of videos and information on other websites and YouTube and Facebook where people confuse these things and start you know thinking or believe that this is some other planet or some other solar system but that's um, with a little bit of research you probably can find that really easy what is these things are Macau I always say I respect other people and people that work try to prove some stuff I respect the work but I think every person that make a research on stuff they should have enough evidence before you know say things or or predict things that even more worse it's really hard to predict an earthquake or a, a disaster so you may have a very solid and a strong evidence before you do something like that well this is right here let me stop the video it's on July 15 around 3 15 in the morning so around 4 o'clock in the morning that was the shooting star this one thing that I want to show this thing right here a lot of people confuse this with objects or stuff lens flares too they're really easy to, to get confused but just look at the way these things are moved you find that really quick what is this now a few more minutes after that and then you see the sunrise and there we go okay before that keep going just wanna point another like I said before any person who take classes uh, photography uh, classes or astronomer or do astrophotography will will know right away these things are really easy to confuse a lot of people believe that this is an object that there are things around the sun but this is just a lens flares they came from the camera it's very normal just look at the way these things are moved and the video stop right there okay let me go back to this thing we find and I like to stop it to show you something all right let's stop right there there's just some much as we can see it first of all this is a lens flare now this is a something this is an object right here and here too over here and this one so I don't know if you probably know what is this right here but let me see something I want to show you something else let's try go to Google and just just click for this and let's just select image let's see this, this looks like a good picture let me try to go on full size okay now look at the way these things are are showing it this is the Pleiades or we can call to the seven sisters we got Jupiter the moon and Venus let me go back and show you with the real picture let me see this one right here it was too small probably you don't see it but this is the Pleiades right here on top Jupiter Jupiter the moon and Venus let's try another good image well, this is a good picture right here it come from CBS News you see the Venus the moon and Jupiter and uh, you don't see it in here but okay I find this website right I find this website and show you uh, moon Venus and Jupiter July 15 you can see them Jupiter, Venus, and the Moon, and the Seven Sisters. Okay, this is another website from spaceweather.com. Uh, this is a picture right here. It was taken on July 15, around 6:30 in the morning. I was taken on Colorado State, and let me click on the picture. This is the person who made the picture, Robert 
iron, I think. Well, this is the thing. We got the Jupiter, uh, the Moon, and Venus. And we got the Seven Sisters in here. Another uh, picture from the same uh, website. It was taken on, on July 15. Uh, let me see. I think this is in a Wisconsin state. We click on the picture to make it big, and we, we see more details of this. There's the Seven Sisters. The Seven Sisters. The Venus, the Moon, and Jupiter. Another website um, taken the same on July 15, around 4 o'clock in the morning. Um, I don't know where I think it's Oregon. Uh, or, uh, I don't know where is this place, but this is the point right here. Let me move this, and we got the same thing again: the Moon, Venus, Jupiter, and the Pleiadians. Okay, this is a picture that I just show you right here, and this is a video of a telescope in Hawaii, and as uh, you can, you know, clearly see what is this object was. This is the Pleiadians right here, the Moon, Venus, and Jupiter. Of course, it looks in a different, a little bit, very small, different uh, position, but it's because they're they're place where they're taken. This one uh, was taken on United States, I think, it was in uh, Oregon, and this one was, you know, taken from a uh, Hawaii. Now, if you go to this website, you know, just click uh, Canada French Hawaii Telescope. There's something you can uh, check in here. Just click about this camera, and you're gonna see a little explanation about what you see in it. This is a camera. It show you um, what are they looking at, looking at the clouds and the sky. But there's something very important point to see. Um, explain in here. This camera is so sensitive. Um, you know, it, it, even the moon appears too bright on the sky you know it, it make you look like it's a huge big object probably like the sun but it's just because the kind of camera they use it in here um, I think I already explained and show you um, what the other uh, right here this is the video that we were, we were talking about probably you already see what I'm, what are these things are obviously it's, it's, it's not a another planet or or solar system or some other stuff it's just the moon Venus and Jupiter and a few hours after that that's the sunset I mean I'm sorry the sunrise I guess that's it guys um, thanks for watching this video and um, with all my respect before you believe something I really recommend you to make your own research